Hey guys, it's Josh here and welcome back to the channel. In today's HomeKit quick tip, I'm going to be showing you how you can get effectively double the functions out of your Eve button. As standard, the Eve button can control three separate scenes with either a single, double or long press. But I'm going to show you how you can get twice as many functions out of the button. Let's jump over to the iPad and I'll show you how. So here we are in the Home app and I've selected the bedroom because that's where my Eve button is. First up, I'll show you how this works and then I'll show you how to program it. So at the moment, the bedroom lights are off. If I single tap, you'll notice the bedroom lights come on. Now if I single tap again, the bedroom lights will go off. This way I've only used one of the button actions to control two separate scenes. The secret to doing this is converting the action to a shortcut. So I'll show you how I've done that. I'll open the E button and then on the single press, open that, then shortcut. The shortcut I've used is a simple IF script. So what happens is on a single press of the button, it will look to see if the bedroom light is off. And if the bedroom light is off, it will then set bedroom daylight scene. Otherwise, if the bedroom is on, set bed off. This way I can control two separate scenes with the one press of the button. I'll now show you how I set this up by using the double press as an example. I'll delete the action I have there set at the moment, and then I'll add a new one. Scroll right to the bottom and choose convert to shortcut. Tap the plus and we need to add the if function. Now for this example, what I'm going to do is have control over my Eve energy by using the double press on the Eve button. So if my Eve energy is on, I want to set Eve energy to off. And then I'll add an extra control of my home. Just hold and drag to put it in line there. So if Eve energy is on, set Eve energy off. But if Eve energy is off, I now want to set Eve energy on. Tap it to set it to turn on. Unfortunately it doesn't say on or off here, but we just have to remember what we set it for. I'll go next, then choose done. And now under double press we have control of the Eve energy. So I'll close that. And now my Eve energy is in my office, so I'll go to the office. At the moment, Eve energy is off. So if I double press, Eve energy comes on. And now if I double press, Eve energy is off. So now effectively I've got four scene controls with the Eve button, but I'm only using the single press and the double press. I now can go back to the bedroom, choose the Eve button, and I can do the same again for the long press. So it's up to you how you want to program it, but using shortcuts is how you effectively double the amount of functions you can get out of the Eve button. I hope you found this HomeKit quick tip helpful. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next one.